Hey guys, it's the next morning. I'm um, doing some work on that 17 Model T engine. I was going into my 26, we came over some transmission problems. Had a lot of play in the drums. The transmission drums slid all over the place. And um, there was some rattling going on. So we had to put the engine on the stand and swap out a transmission from the, I believe it was the 26. I have three Model T engines lying around. There's one of them. That's the one that came out of the car. Transmission and rotating assembly is in good shape, but the cylinders aren't. They had to head off for about 50 years. So, yeah. That one's going up to my friend's garage. Um, and in here, we have the 17 engine. Uh, it's pretty dark in here. But I'll go plug in my shop. I've got power running from the barn. So yeah, plus the car is in there too, and i got to drag that out. And we're going to have to throw the engine in it. And uh, gotta put, also, before that, i got to put the transmission cover back on and throw the bands in it. So I had to, I took out the bands and I rivet, riveted new band lining on them. So, yeah. Or it doesn't want to plug in here. Gotta go give it some more from this side. See, I don't know if you can see it, but so anyway. Also, I've been up to a whole bunch of other stuff. If you look at my um, one of my earlier videos, I got a World War II generator and a Continental Vietnam War area generator, and I um, got those running. Well, no, I didn't get the World War II one running. I just got the Continental one. It's having some fuel troubles, but yeah, it's got old gas, so I don't, it probably doesn't have fuel troubles, I have to go and clean the bowl and whatnot. So yeah, let's see here if it'll give me enough slack to plug it in. There we go. Now we can actually see you over there. And also, you see, here's the Model T. It's sort of dark in here. With the 51 packed in here for now, and all the, a lot of the parts that came off that. But anyway, yeah, we had to move stuff in and out all the time. We'd rather work outside yesterday. It started to rain. Had to get the tractor with the engine inside. That happened a few times. There's the 17 engine. New transmission in it. Doesn't have any play in the drums besides side to side, which most of all we do. Try to find one. It doesn't. Here's the old transmission. It's got the magneto ring, the magnets in along it to generate the power. That's not the timing like on a lawnmower engine. It has a timer on the front that just generates power for the ignition. And this all the NH carburetor, the stainless carburetors. Fine. Yeah, they tucked back in there. But anyway, I'll be posting videos of us hopefully throwing the engine in it. So, thanks for watching, guys.